Hey, it's Josh here from Create Studio, and I'm super excited to show you inside our latest Doodle Text Creator. So let's hop over inside the software, and I'll show you how you can create your own Doodle Text scenes inside Create Studio. Cool, so it's really simple to do, and what you wanna do first of all is just simply add your text layer. So let's go and add the text here, and I'll make this text black, like so. And let's go ahead and say, let's doodle like so okay so you just add your text down like that you can make it as big as you like you can adjust the text font if you like um, but just add your text and then click on the drop down menu over here and then click on the plus icon to add a text effect and then you simply select doodle over here and you're about to see we've got this really nice looking doodle animation one thing you will also want to do is adjust the rotation point so select the layer and just click on the rotation point and make sure that you select top left um, and that's just going to enable the text to uh, stay where it is and it will enable the you know the hand to write like that okay so you can also adjust the duration so if you want to make it slower just bring this out like this and i'll just show you what this looks like like that okay cool so yeah you can also you know position it where you like and as you do that the hand will automatically you know readjust so it's all you know done automatically um, with the technology that we've built into this. So I'm just gonna go through and go back over here and you can see we've got a whole bunch of different hands. Um, we've got some real looking hands, we've got a chalk hand. So let's say for example, if you want it like this kind of chalk looking one like that, you can do that. Um, you can also select 3D character hands. So again, we've got like a marker pen one like this. Looks pretty cool. Um, and we've got a whole bunch of other really nice looking ones. We've got 2D ones as well. So if you've, you know, you make, if you're creating an explainer video with 2D characters, it's good to use one like that, for example. Um, if you're using a 3D character one, you can go and grab one of these ones. And you can see we've got a whole bunch of them. So it really gives you lots of variety and possibilities um, when you're writing and creating your doodle videos, okay? Even got chalk ones like that. So let's just play this through. Just like that you can quickly and easily create your text animations and I'm just going to um, go over here and duplicate that and let's just bring this over like so so that after this doodle finishes we want to add some more text I'm just going to select this text layer and just bring it down um, let's say in create studio like that I might make this a little bit bigger Okay, like that. So this is coming over like this. It's looking really good. Maybe I'd adjust that hand and use a marker pen for this one. So maybe something like, maybe even like a, this tattoo one. It's kind of cool actually. Um, and you can you know, obviously adjust the hands like that. Um, and what you can also do if you select this and go back into the text settings, you can see you can adjust the size of the hands. If you want to make it really big or much smaller, you can do that as well. Um, and it, automatically updates to make sure that it's in sync with your text. So let's just preview that. Cool. So that's one of our updates that we've just added, which is a really special update that we've put in. Um, another thing we've also done is we've added the ability to add different contrast and uh, saturation and different filters onto your images. So let's go over and I'll import some media actually. So let's go with uh, mountains this and let's say I want to go grab maybe something like this one looks quite nice so I'm just going to import this image and then go back over here so let's have a look there we go so I'm just going to grab this image here and just scale it up like that um, so over on the advanced settings over here you have to see we've got some options so we've got brightness and contrast so you can adjust the brightness um, this is really good also for green screen editing so to help you with your um, to make a nice clean cut you can adjust the brightness and the contrast um, you can see you can really play around with these and you know adjust your images and your videos um, with the brightness and contrast and you can also apply filters onto your layers let's go for example grayscale got sepia um, brownie vintage or polaroid so yeah that looks really really nice um, and with these, just to note, uh, in the editor, when you're applying filters, because it applies a filter onto every pixel of the image or the video, um, it can slow down the editor. Um, but when you render the video, it will be like normal. So this is one thing to note. 
Um, but yeah, those are our main updates inside Create Studio. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have, make sure to add a like to this video and would really appreciate it if you could add a review to Trustpilot or on our Facebook page. Um, that just really helps us, you know, in building our company. So yeah, thanks again. And yeah, make sure to download the latest version to see these updates inside your software and have a great day.